ISIS philosophy. So it's very accepting. And um, also, I see ISIS as a, a nature goddess. So the people that um, come here are not to expect any dogma. There's no one way of doing anything. And we call what we uh, do katma instead of dogma. And even though that's a little humorous, I enjoy humor a lot. The ancient traditions were very pure. And then as we go along in, in humanity, um, we get more muddled all the time. And of course, we become more of a patriarchal society from the beginning, or very early times. Women were honored as goddesses and priestesses. And, and then um, that all changed. When we have our little ceremonies, it's always all-inclusive. Sometimes we call them sheremonies rather than ceremonies because we like to see people sharing. We don't want to be preaching at anybody or anything. Everybody should have their own path to their own spirituality. Well, it, nobody knows what the ancient traditions really were. And I think today a young priestess who's in, kind of in training here, um, I told her, uh, kind of carry on with the ceremony today. We just kind of are like nature, you know? It's just a beautiful thing and it's all connected. And, and we're always in awe of all the beauty in nature. And, uh, that's why I keep the cats and the birds and I'm gonna be adding an insect zoo soon. So I have uh, definitely followed um, the Isis path. And uh, that's why I chose to stay for the book. The goddess bade me do it. <laughs>